Right now we're heading to a 100,000 square foot warehouse in Suffolk, Virginia. I have students in my car with me now, we're driving, um, to take a tour on the warehousing side of things. Because we not only teach, so the disciplines we teach, I should say it like this, dispatcher 101, freight broker 101, trucking, and then we do government contracts, intermodal, and warehousing and distribution. So warehousing and distribution piece, you're gonna see uh, a huge, fully furnished warehouse that's actually doing things, doing work. They're consolidating freight, they're uh, transloading, cross-docking, uh, inventory management, storage, you're gonna see it's packed. It's a, and 100,000 square feet is huge. So uh, you're gonna get a glimpse of that today. Like, you can't rely on one customer. That'll yeah. be the, I, I can't tell you how many big customers, yeah, how many, how many big customers we've had come and go. We used to do Sam's Club, we used to do, still do Amazon. Uh, we do, they used to do a ton of Amazon, then it's left Amazon, now it's more Amazon, and then it's, you know, whoever. But you gotta have a lot of different hands in the pot to be successful, because if the moment you rely on one customer, that they'll dry up and you're, you're left paying a, you know, a $75,000 building. 